Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for joining me again. And if you're new here, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video is a new in haul. I don't do these that often because I really don't buy a lot of new clothes all the time. So I like to do them every couple of months and save up some bits and bobs and keep them aside to show you. So I've now got a good selection of things that I can share with you and I absolutely love every single piece. They are so beautiful, great for summer, but also a couple of them would be great for autumn as well. I've got some kind of more evening pieces, things that are very different from my usual style. Um, but I'm really excited to wear them on holiday. I thought I would just do this video nice and chilled. I've got my silk dressing gown on. This is from um, Victoria's Secret. And I thought I would just keep this on and show you the pieces and then do some cutaways and you can see them on. So first of all, I'm gonna start with probably my most favorite thing in this whole haul. Is this absolutely incredible skirt from Nadine Marabi. They are such a beautiful brand for statement evening wear pieces this is absolutely gorgeous look how amazing this is feathers all along the bottom of the mini skirt is such a beautiful color it's kind of like a mix between blue and lilac i'd say it's like a periwinkle blue is that the right periwinkle is that the right word um but i just absolutely love this and i really don't wear a lot of color but when it's something like this and it's a statement i think oh it just looks gorgeous I've actually styled this up with a white shirt, kind of unbuttoned, and some nude heels, and I just think it looks stunning. But imagine this in um, winter time with like black, a really amazing black, like long sleeve top with shoulder pads, my Dior heels. I think this would be so beautiful. I absolutely love it. I'm gonna take this on my trip to Cyprus at the end of August and give it all the love that it deserves in golden hour. I think it's gonna be gorgeous. I got this in a size extra small, it fits perfectly. It's the perfect kind of mini skirt length, I find. It's not too short, not too long, it really suits me, I think. I'm five foot three, and sometimes if mini skirts are too long, it looks a bit like, makes my legs look quite small, whereas this is the perfect length for me. Another holiday piece, these are pretty much all holiday pieces to be honest, but I would also wear them in the UK as well. This dress is absolutely beautiful. This is from Forever New, which if you guys have followed me for a while, you will know I absolutely love Forever New. They do some amazing pieces. They're kind of so underrated, I think. I don't think they have enough credit. They do such good quality things. They fit like a glove. This is a really gorgeous brown, kind of like a knitted crochet dress. Um, so gorgeous. It's got a slip underneath it to about the knee and then at the bottom of it is just a sheer crochet. Fits so nicely. I love the cut of the top here and then the back is a little bit backless and you just tie um, this together at the top just to bring it in a little bit tighter. I got this in a size six and oh, I just love brown. I think brown is such a really underrated colour as well. This looks so gorgeous with heels in the evening, like a wedge or sandals in the daytime. I think this also in autumn will be so beautiful with some boots, a leather jacket, a blazer. Absolutely love it. I feel like you literally cannot go wrong with white linen in the summer. This is just me to a T. This gorgeous set is from Dish, which is such a beautiful band. And I've actually shared this on Instagram already. And some of you were asking me, do you have to pay customs? And I always kind of leave links to everything below and sizing and information and stuff. This piece was actually sent to me via PR, so I don't, didn't have to pay custom. So I'm not 1000% sure if you will, but I did have a look online and it does say that the customer is liable for the custom fees. So I guess just be wary about that if you're gonna order. Um, but I also would suggest to look on Depop, Vestia, eBay, sites like the secondhand sites. Um, because you never know, someone might be selling it and you won't have to pay customs. So the top is just a really beautiful, almost like a t-shirt vibe. Linen, so lightweight, it gathers here, so it's a bit of a crop. But if you wear it with high-waisted trousers, your kind of tummy is actually like a tiny little gap. Oh, I just think this is so lovely. And I'd even wear this with just jeans, a skirt, a slip skirt would look so beautiful. Oh, I really love it. And this linen is really, really amazing quality. I've ironed this and I've had it like screwed up in a ball in my suitcase. I took it away at the weekend and it's not creased at all. So it's such a good durable fabric for traveling as well. I got this in a size six and I just absolutely love it. It's so beautiful. 
And then obviously to go with the top, I had to choose the trousers as well. Again, I got these in a six. I have actually literally just worn these in Leeds at the weekend and I wore these with, I'll put a picture in on screen how I wore them with some really big wedges and oh my god I absolutely loved my outfit I felt I felt like one of those um school mums my mum used to wear linen trousers and wedges all the time literally the whole summer she'd pick us up from school in her linen trousers her wedges she was a very classy mum um so I literally just felt like I was living my mum dream but these are so beautiful. They fit me so well. They are a little bit too long. I can't really wear them with flats without them dragging on the floor. Um, so I think I might get them taken up a little bit just so that they can just skim the floor when I'm wearing flats because I would like these to be an everyday trouser. But I got a size six and they fit me perfectly. Pockets, really, really gorgeous linen as well. As you can see, like I have worn these and had them scrumpled up and they still look fine i would iron these if i was going to wear them again but they need a wash but yeah absolutely perfect you can't go wrong with a linen trouser they just go with everything and actually stay tuned on my instagram because i'm going to be posting a few reels in the next few weeks to show you how i style up my staple pieces in summer and then i'll kind of carry it on seasonal okay going back to a little bit of color another forever new dress and oh god this is so beautiful I really cannot wait to wear this. When I wear colour, I always tend to go for like a pinky or a blue. There's no in between. I literally just go down the pink spectrum or the blue. I don't really ever go for like greens or yellows or anything like that. Um, but this is so pretty. It's got this lovely square neckline. Kind of like milkmaid style with the puff sleeves. And then the um, little bodice section here is almost like pleated. So pretty. It's a full long midi dress. Oh my god, I just love it. Zips up at the side, so it really kind of just like, oh, it's just so beautiful. I got it in a size six, and this colour is just so pretty. I love this um, pattern. It's really gorgeous floral. This would be a really good wedding dress as well. Um, summer wedding, or if you've got like an ascot races, events, whatever, summer garden parties. But I'm definitely going to take this on holiday and have it as one of my evening dresses, because I just think it is so beautiful. Okay, I've got a couple more dresses to share with you. Another dish piece. This is so pretty. When I wore this the other day, I actually had um, a little lady come up to me and say, you look so pretty, I love your dress, you look amazing. Oh, so cute. Um, but yeah, I absolutely love this. I've already shared this on Instagram and you guys went wild for this dress. Um, but it's got a v-neck at the front, the same linen fabric as the trousers and the top lovely little like pleated puff sleeves it kind of gathers in at the waist a little bit not a lot but just a really small bit and then again like a full skirt it's got pockets as well which is really nice and the back just has this pleat detail all along the sides to kind of just like tie in with the sleeves and i just think this is beautiful it's such an easy summer throw on dress another amazing holiday piece and you can style this up with some gorgeous tan accessories add some black even like a colored handbag colored heels love it it's so pretty my last dress is a black one this is from pretty lavish lydia did a collection with them so this is one of the pieces from her collection she's absolutely nailed it with like the classic chic timeless style but with a little bit of an edge like the cutouts oh love it so this dress has got a really gorgeous cutout on the waist, little ring detail here in the middle, v-neck, lovely kind of like soft cotton um, pleated material, really lovely wide sleeves, and then it just goes down to the floor with a little slit at the side. I got this in a size six, and I would say this comes up very oversized. I think if you can size down, definitely do, because um, I found this came up a lot bigger on me. I'll show you in the cutaways, but... The sleeves are a lot longer and the overall fit of the dress is a little bit too big for me, but I think I can make it work. I think if I take a little bit of length off the bottom of the dress and wear it as a more casual kind of beach wear, I think that's what I'm going to do um, on holiday and I think it's going to be beautiful. Okay, and my last final thing I wanted to share with you are my new sandals. So you guys know I am obsessed with the June loop. I think it's Lupe or Loop, I don't know sandals they are amazing they are such a good dupe for the Hermes Oran sandals such a fraction of the price amazing quality but I really 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 have always wanted a pair of Oran sandals 
um, and I always check on Depop, eBay, Vestia, Luxury Promise, Designer Exchange, all of these secondhand stores. I always check before I buy something brand new, especially with shoes. I don't know why, but shoes and bags, I'm always looking for secondhand. Um, maybe if it's more like sunglasses or belts, something that could get a bit more ruined, I'd just buy it new. Um, but to be honest, these sandals are, I think, quite a reasonable price, brand new, especially seeing as they're um, as I think they're a good price. I think they're around 480, I think. I'm not 100 percent sure. Um, but I bought these secondhand and I think I got about 120 pounds off the original price. Um, they had been worn by a girl. I had a massive chat with her, I always do. And I think she'd worn them once or twice, but they didn't really fit her. So she wanted to sell them and get a new size. Um, so these are the sandals, gorgeous. I absolutely love them. They are the tan shade with the white stitching. And oh my God, I just love them. They are so comfortable. And I actually don't have any tan handbags, belts, shoes, I don't own any tan accessories at all and it's something that I've really realised this year that I love and I just am lacking of so I wanted to invest in a good pair of tan sandals that I could wear year on year, I could wear these all the way into autumn as well, they are just so beautiful, they really suit my style I think. You might remember in my recent vlog when I was in London with Nadia, I tried on the tan Celine belt which I didn't pick up, but it's still on my wish list. So I think I'm going to, now I've got some shoes, I'm gonna get a tan belt, and then my next purchase will probably be a tan bag, but we shall see. I don't like to rush these things. So yeah, I absolutely love these. These are in a size 36, which is my usual size. They fit me perfectly, they are so comfortable. Um, I've worn these so much since getting them a couple of weeks ago, and they haven't rubbed at all, and I am honestly so prone to getting blisters. If I showed you my feet right now after the weekend wearing heels pretty much the whole time, I think you would be sick. I literally have the worst blisters in the world and my feet are in agony. Um, so I'm very prone to getting blisters. It's kind of a running joke in the family that I always get blisters every single day. I don't know why, I don't know what it is. I just, me and Compede are like, we're like this. So anyway, I haven't had any blisters with these. They are so comfortable and yeah, I love them. So. I do think though, I still absolutely love the June sandals and I always will and I've got the white ones, the black ones and I have actually just seen they've got like a raffia material so I might get that for my holiday um, but yeah, I think they're incredible, they're such a good price and if it wasn't for finding this exact colour, my size, with such a good discount second hand, I probably wouldn't have got them because I love the June ones so much. But yeah, I think it's nice to invest in things that you know you love and are kind of tried and tested in your wardrobe and you know that you're going to have them and love them forever. So that brings me to the end of this little haul. I hope you have enjoyed it. Let me know your favourite piece down below and I would love to hear from you in the comments. Let me know what you're up to, how you're feeling, what are you buying recently, have you got any trips coming up. I am going to Cyprus at the end of August and I've taken my mum away for her birthday at some point but I'm not sure where we're going yet. I think it's going to be a bit of a last minute trip. Possibly Parma but I'm not 100% sure yet. So I'm very excited to get into my summer wardrobe and fully involve myself because I haven't actually been on holiday yet this summer so I'm very excited to get away at the end of summer. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok at Lauren Grace Life if you're not already. TikTok's just an extra E on the end. I'm really active over on both of those platforms all the time and I'm always sharing what I'm up to and more home content and wellness and all of that stuff so don't forget to follow me if you're not already and i will see you in my next video bye